Well, good evening, Internet. It's me, D.P. Knuton, for another exciting edition of Bookward Bound, my 301-day journey from I should really do this to done. And what is that done? Well, that done is the creation of a brand new book by January 1st, 2021. And uh, you've actually seen the cover of the book already. It looks a little something like this. It's called Nonfiction Brand, Discover, Craft, and Communicate the Completely True, Completely You Brand You Already Are. Yep, that's what the book is about, and that's what I'll be writing about tonight, as uh, this is another one of my 301-day live streams as I write the book in real time. And I'm sorry, I was looking for my little paper here that gives me the actual night. Um, This is day 187 consecutively that I have come down here to work on this book. So that's great. I've got 114 days left to go before the end of the year, before it's uh, December 31st of 2020. And the book better be done then because the very next day, January 1st of 2021, I'm going to be uploading the press ready PDF files to Amazon's Kindle direct publishing space, where I will in fact be publishing this brand new book. Crazy, right? Yeah, a little too crazy if you ask me. So uh, I better get my butt in gear and actually start writing. So what am I doing tonight? Well, you know, some nights I write, some nights I edit, some nights I design, blah, 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 blah. Well, tonight I'm going to go right away over to Scrivener, the application I'm using to write the book. And you can see it right here. That's where you write the book or right here. That's where you write the book. And then over here is where you've got all your chapters and stuff like that. Now, I've been messing around a little bit. And I have started playing around with adding a new feature at the end of each of my little case stories about people. Where I create this thing I'm calling the nonfiction brand moral of whoever's story. In this case, it's the moral of Balash Ferenzi's story, which I wrote about up here. There's Balash right there and etc cetera, etc cetera. well there's got to be a moral to the story and so that's what i added down here so i think what i'm going to do tonight is add this little feature to the bottom of every buddy's story so the uh, stephanie's story um Oh, live streaming. Your flag in one hyper specific area does not stop you from doing anything but oh come on I just want lowercase but I'll have to go back and fake out the program that wants to initial cap it but ah dang it gives your your audience uh hyper specific reason to engage with you on everything you have to offer So let's just say that that's planting your flag in one hyper-specific area does not stop you from doing anything. But it does, but, but it gives your your now interested 
audience uh, everything you have to offer cool good enough there leah bach let's go look at leah there's leah hello leah i gotta grayscale your photos but we'll get to that uh I don't need this. This feature down here, I'm getting rid of. Uh, so what are we talking about with Leah? A realtor is one of many. the best way to avoid being lumped into a commodity barrel is to demonstrate you're not one in everything you do and even in the car you drive uh something like that uh, let's see one through to demonstrate uh, the absolutely true you is is not one in everything you do even in the car you drive Something like that. Yeah, that's cool. All right, so podcast button. Let me come face to face, face to feed the trust chain. Yeah. Ooh, yeah, I got to fix all this stuff up by making sure it's the right. Paragraph copy, and this is number five. Oops. Heading two. Two. Five, five. And this will be two. Wait a minute, I gave these all. It's two. Okay, so that doesn't have one of those. So we can make that a yellow, change icon to yellow. Oh, just, gotta, uh, just see if anyone's watching on Facebook. If you are, in fact, watching this live stream and you want to say hello, you can. All you have to do 
is in the comment box below where you're watching this video just type something in and in fact I'm opening up Facebook so we can make that a yellow icon just to see if anyone's commenting and nobody is but that's okay back to work um, got that yellow got that green so again, I'm going through and I'm looking for where I'm talking about other people. Is this a Sarah Townsend? Yeah, Sarah Townsend. I'm going to shrink this down a little to about 150. For now, anyway. So I can do this. My story. You are. Sarah to save decades working for others and instead um, instead uh, save decades working for others instead allowed her to pour all her effort into building something that was completely hers. Not a bad strategy, if you ask me. Not a bad strategy, is it? Is it? Instead, enabled her. Yeah. Or to pull her, all her effort into building. All her effort into building something that was completely hers. Personal brand and building things that are complete. A couple of things that are completely unalterably hers. in the company it's built on to it's founded upon upon how about that Cool. Uh, Bea. Bea Pola Boker.
Simplize, she started out mastering systems. There's something we didn't really share significant. Of its own. If it doesn't, I don't think it qualifies as a personal brand. You start is simply that the place where your personal brand journey began. Knowing that that pivot point Knowing that personal development and change is inevitable, it's imperative to identify the things. the aspects about you, the unique about you that cannot, will not and must not change. Cannot, will not, and must not change. Yeah, digging that. You know, really come all comes down to this. A personal brand is something you can never sell. So I've got Neil in two different places. Uh, I might have to move Neil's stuff a little bit. The nonfiction brand moral of the story. Let's say it again. Moral of Jay's story. Let's say it again. Uh, if you don't own it, it's not yours. But your personal brand, including the visual packaging of it, that's 100% yours. That's 100%. That's 100% yours. So own it. And own it big time. Non film. Jay's. Neil. Neil's. Story. All right, so when I wrote about Neil, step out from behind. Yeah, that's a big. I got to cut some of this out. Let's go to.
to something you can notice now. Yeah. We'll leave it at that. What was it before? It really comes down to this. Yeah, that's placeholder. That's placeholder or garbage writing. All right, so Dana Sanchez. If you think, think the place you're working couldn't exist without you. And you don't own it. Be prepared. Be prepared. Stuff happens. Be prepared. Uh, what do I want to say about her? The worst. If you think the place you're working could and you don't own it. Yeah, let's make that long dashes. Because I love my favorite punctuation mark is a M dash. The width of an M. Yeah, 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 yeah. If you think the place you're working couldn't exist without you and you don't own it, be prepared. Only thing truly own is you, who you are, what you do, and how you do it. Yeah, I'll leave it for that that for now. J penchant for plaid. Uh, Equinox. That's not about anybody. Um, uh, Justin. Great TMI. Is not an in some professional and and in many. How about that? And in professional cases. It it pays to be strategic, smart, and savvy. It pays to be strategic, smart, and savvy. Mm. 
then sometimes silent. How about that? Yeah. Yeah, I kind of like that. I have stuff about Roger in here. Let's go. But I'm just a plumber. to do uh, narrow range of activities every day but never forget your mundane Activity is someone gives you a highly a valuable, valuable expertise in someone else's eyes. The question is, are those eyes saying what you're seeing your expertise? in action. Yeah, that's kind of cool. That'll work for now. Logo is not a brand. story No, I don't need that. I'm not giving her. Nah. Nah. Not going to give her one. She's too big. She's a big fish. For the first time. That's dumb. I don't like that.
So where am I? I gotta look down here. Plant and pivot. Sorry, Kate. I don't think I'm going to do you. Power of consistency, microphone, that would be good. Balash. Balash, you get to go to change icon to blue. Blue means that um, it's uh, not final proofed, but it's in good shape and more or less done. Yeah, I got pull quotes in there. I should actually get Dana. Uh, where's Dana? Right here. Change her to a yellow. Because I need to get a pull quote. That's just a reminder. So Richard Moore, Lennon, I'm still there. Reveal that Paul Romando, Perth, Australia, Sarah Gross. Yeah, we can be that's a separate book. So I think that's going. Yeah, I need to make a note of that. Oh, good. New book branding under an umbrella. Just making a note to self that as soon as this book's done, I got to write another one. What an idiot. I tell you. <laughs> and that's what happens when you start writing. You start getting a ton of material and then you go, ah, oh, this is too much material. And then you realize, oh, this is actually another book. So I need to open I Thoughts. File open recent. What do I want to? I think it was under brand courses, maybe. We go new book. Um, umbrella. with a sub uh, while working for theirs. You're creating your brand while we're... How about that? And then I wanna make sure that I, oops. Go uh, Rose. She's my poster child for that. Uh, where's my trash folder? Hello, trash folder. Yeah, all this stuff. See, already I've gotten rid of a bunch of crap. Have I written about Christian yet? Yeah, I have. I've got. Ooh, I can give him his.
He didn't qualify, but he sure didn't lose by doing what he did the way he did. Proved himself to be the winner. The winner he truly wanted to be. Something like that. Uh, I'm not loving it. Um, Opponent panel, let's make this a lot smaller. So I'll need to go through this again. But and I need to get a photo. Yeah. So yeah, keep it yellow. All right. Oh, sorry. Uh, I had my screen blocked so you couldn't see what I was doing. But I was over here working on this section. Which is very strange why it's doing that. Oh, I know why it's doing that. All right. Um, yeah. Okay. So I'm starting my... I'm starting to go into a recursive loop. So uh, I think now is the time for me to stop for the evening. And that's okay because, uh, as I've said earlier, I still have 114 days left to go to create this book before December 31st, 2021. So needless to say, I don't need to burn myself out tonight doing it. So I'm not going to. That's it for me tonight. I'm D.P. Knuton for the Nonfiction Brand Podcast. I hope you'll take a listen to that podcast. Uh, this week has the first episode with... Uh, Christian Small, who is this really great Australian golf pro who really did something quite amazing. And we talk about it in episode 107 of the Nonfiction Brand Podcast. So I'll, I hope you'll take a listen to that. You can find the podcast wherever fine podcasts are free. Just search Nonfiction Brand Podcast or Nonfiction Brand. Yeah, just search Nonfiction Brand. Nonfiction, all one word, and you're going to find it. And you'll probably also see my picture that looks a little something like that. Yep, that's the picture you're looking for. If you find it, you'll know it's me. That's it for me tonight. Thank you so much for helping keep me honest and make me come down here and work on the book even when I didn't want to. I'll see you tomorrow. But until then, theme music, take us on out. I'll see you tomorrow.